I think when I was young, I didn't know why I didn't like it. And then as I got older, I realized the reason I wasn't enjoying meat products or even dairy products for that matter was the fact that I knew where it was coming from. And that kind of didn't sit well with me. Hey, this is Claude Kelly, and I'm here for PETA 2. I've been a vegetarian for 12 years, and I became a vegan five years into that. As I became more aware of the world around me, and you know, what exactly, you know, eating meat was and slaughtering animals and you know, all the stuff that goes into that. It became a, more of a social, political issue. It starts with, you know, you doing small things within your life, in your refrigerator, um, in your community to, to, to make little lifestyle changes. Um, my family's West Indian, so I replaced tofu with all the meat dishes that they make. So it tastes no different and it's really good. My advice would be to do what makes you feel comfortable. And for me, what makes me feel comfortable is to not eat meat products and eat from certain companies that don't treat animals properly. Definitely go to peer.org. And, if, you, and if, that, if what you see there enlightens you, and I'm sure it will, then you make a decision based off of your own morals and your own conscience at that point.